In this video I'm going to be explaining to you the Tyndall effect that can be used to find the difference between a suspension, a colloid, and a solution. For the Tyndall effect um, you need a flashlight with a bright light on it, um, but each of these beakers has recently been stirred, so to do the Tyndall effect you shine a flashlight through the substance and if it scatters light that means that it's either a suspension or a colloid. In this beaker you can see that there's a glow in the liquid inside of the beaker. In this one you can also see a glow in the liquid inside of a beaker, which means that one of these is a colloid and the other is a suspension. Once you've decided that, you can determine if it's a suspension if there are particles that have settled to the bottom, such as this one. So this beaker contains a suspension. It has large particles that sink to the bottom and they also scatter light. In this beaker is a colloid. It also scatters light, but it does not have large particles that sink to the bottom. The third beaker is a solution. To determine if it's a solution, shine the light through and if there's no distinct glow inside the liquid, then it is a solution. That means it has small particles that do not scatter light and do not sink to the bottom. And that is the Tyndall effect.